Hello everyone, in this video we're gonna go through updated Locket widget app and some maybe hidden features you didn't know about or like how to use it. So basically Locket widget app is, is quite popular app these days which helps you to put your friends on your home screen. So basically what you can do here, so for example I just have this camera, I can take a photo and then um, like what I can do with it. I can send it to my friends uh, and send it to their home screen. Uh, so for example, I uh, select this photo and then I can just tap send. So that's like the basic scene, what you can do with the app. Of course, you can take a much better photo. Uh, like the next step is that you need to install this, this kind of widget on your phone. So just tap and hold, you will see all the apps jiggling tap on plus and then you have lock it widget and then you can install two sizes you can tap add widget and then you it can start jiggling so you can tap and then you can tap edit widget and then uh, pick a widget I will show you how to do this because this is actually a recent update in the app now you can finally can add multiple widget for 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 different people and but before that so just you understand like so if your friends send pictures to you that your friends pictures will appear here and the photo i just sent it will appear on on the on the people's phones yeah so that's pretty cool like you don't need to go to whatsapp app or messenger or like open app open your chat and like see uh, pictures you can just see them updated in real time on your home screen and there are much apps like that there is noted widget app there is live in widget so these are these apps are going viral these days and like the the new addition to to this is that you can finally add multiple widgets so tap in top left here you can create this widget you can name it uh, so you can name it by the by the people you want to include in this widget and then you can just add friends i just have one friend here uh, and then basically you just add it um, and from here you can then add it who you want uh, like which widget you want to be displayed so as you can see here i have all my widgets so for example like if i want to see photos from my class friends i select this if i want to see uh, photos from my colleagues or from other group i just select that and uh, like the cool part about it is that before before this update if you had 10 friends in locket widget then uh, you would receive all the photos from these 10 friends and this would be a mix because some photos probably are quite personal some other photos are from your friends some other for from like colleagues and all everything in one stream that's not that cool here you can just have it separately in different widgets so that's an amazing new feature and now there is no friend limit in in the in the locket widget app so you can invite from other apps uh, so you can invite from snapchat from messages or like uh, using a link but for example if you want to invite from snapchat just use this native integrated option because then you have this kind of like very cool uh, filter like something like that and people will just see your story and they can swipe up and yeah that's better than just copying a link um, yep, so that's that's the app then in top left you have all the instructions in case you didn't uh, Understand it like how to add the widget Hold down on any app Tap the plus button in the top left corner search for locket and add the widget. So that's that's that uh, Then you can see the instruction here how to customize the widget um, So yep here's the full instruction uh, this is how you can add all these widgets um, then you can see your history uh, this is what we just sent uh, i can delete this photo 
I can comment on it, but then it will just basically send as a message. I can add a reaction and then I can share and export it. I can see where this uh, photo was, was sent and I can uh, select uh, to which widget there were this photo sent. So that's, that's basically that. Um, yep, so that's the idea. I uh, hope this was helpful. That's the app. Definitely give it a try. As you can see, there is no premium subscription. I'm using it for free. Uh, the one the one thing is that I think you need to have on iPhone iOS 13 plus uh, So it's it's already quite old basically you need to have operation system which supports widgets um, And yeah, that's the idea uh, Hope this is helpful. Thank you for watching